wishing you peace, light, and joy. This is my first video on using GAN for trading. This is not financial advice. I am not a certified licensed advisor in any sense of the word. Do not take this as what to do. It's my own thoughts. You can listen to this and make your own decisions afterwards or go to a professional. So I thought we'd start right about here. Gan would have said this is an important point. I won't get into that now, but we see right after that price went up. It crossed the Gan's square of nine, went right up to resistance line, which is based on the astronomy of the planets, the numbers of the planets. It got resistance there. It fell back down to the square of nine for it found support. Then it went up and played and danced around and it danced around so long this is a very makes this a very strong line because as you know from regular support and resistance anyway the price then shot up again it crossed another very important line which uh, a square of nine as well as an astrology or astronomy line it would have been in my mind i would have thought oh that's double it probably would stop there but it didn't it went up some more it went up through another square of nine line it went up through again 50 percent line it even went up slightly above the next GAN astrology line. So this showing the market is super strong. It played around here, danced back and forth over that line, went up, it pulled, fell all the way back down to the 50% line, and then just shot right back up again. And it wound up coming to this next, almost exactly to the GAN astrology line. So these are all important turning points. How do you know it's going to last here or there? Well, you don't. That's where your other TA uh, charting stop losses and when to get in, entry and exit points comes in. GAN has his rules too, but here I'm just showing you how when we get to this point, we say, well, this is a likely turning point. And sure enough, it didn't quite make it, turned around the next day and kept coming down to the previous GAN line where, remember before down here, I said there's a lot of activity respecting this line making it more important same thing here not as long but sure enough it came back price came back down and found support there now here here is here's a GAN entry a very aggressive person would be getting in right there it hit the line or came close to the line they might get in GAN says a more conservative approach would be come up get down retest and get in and that's if you were in that either of those positions you see why this one seems to be better if you have timing if you have an option in play you would have saved three days on your option call anyway i ran a trend line on the price where will it go next well will it break or will it be rejected by this astrology line if so then we would expect it either to retest go sideways or to fall back down here and then possibly trend the channel sideways. If it breaks free, I'm just using this trend line as a guesstimate in terms of time. The next big line to consider, resistance line would be the 86.616 line. It also has a GAN square 9 right next to it, just as it does here. So that is how to look at GAN, whether you're using the square of 9, whether you're using, you could put Fibonacci on here and trade it the same way. And um, maybe I'll do that as well. Wishing you peace, love, light, and joy. Thank you.